Hey. Good morning. We've got the car packed up. Ready to go. My last days in Florida. Wow, it's crazy that two years have flown by. But we're moving on. Onwards and upwards. Literally, north. But um, first thing I want to do is just give a tremendous thank you to uh, Charles and Anna, I'm sure. I'm sure you guys are watching. It's been a blast. Thank you for uh, your hospitality over the past year and a half or so. Um, you guys are you guys are now family, and I um, couldn't have couldn't have asked for uh, for better roommates over the time that I was here. So I greatly appreciate it. Ana, muchísimas gracias, Pato. Gracias. All right, let's hit the road. Next stop, Jacksonville. You guys can see me. I don't know how the lighting is. We're just stopping at a little rest stop here. It's been about three and a half hours. Making good time. We had some a bunch of traffic near West Palm Beach that kind of set us back, but I think we're about two hours away. Smooth sailing though right now. It's beautiful out, but no traffic. No traffic. <sighs> Feeling good. Boulevard, Daytona Beach. We saw the speedway from uh, from 95, so we're about a little over an hour outside of Jacksonville. So still feeling good, still feeling good, making good time. And I think we're gonna have a little bit of soccer tonight, which I am really, really looking forward to. Um, hopefully Jake gets his buddies to come out. We'll get a little footy going, so that'll be nice. So we have made it to destination one this little road trip back north Jake Buttick's house yeah, out here out here in Jackson we have to we have to use a leaf blower to clear the clear the court before we could play Super excited to get some touches in though, it should be fun. A lot of people out here, 5v5, should get a good run in. Nice. We are on the move again, leaving Jacksonville, on the way to DC for the weekend. Uh, big shout out to the Puddicks, Jake, good to see you buddy. Uh, thanks to your parents as well for having me, uh, good to get a little footy in. Uh, you know, until next time, we'll see you again. Had a little bit of breakfast and 10 hour drive ahead of us. Probably getting into DC around 8 or 9 o'clock tonight. later it's passed through into South Carolina still feeling good all right so we just stopped off just to use the restroom real quick shake out the legs we're like an hour or an hour away from North Carolina I believe like 30 miles outside of Florence and I think it's like an hour from here until the border of North Carolina making good time should be arriving in DC about 8 30 hopefully easy drive just basically uh, it's basically 95 the whole way 
feeling good though. Let's get back to it. This guy right here decided to pick up and move his whole house to causing traffic for like the last three miles. Goodness gracious people. It is about 10 past three. Just crossed into North Carolina. It took about three hours to get through South Carolina. So not too bad. Not too bad. We're making our way. We're inching closer. Probably about four, four or five hours left, I would say. Uh, and I might stop to grab uh, to grab some food for dinner. But three ten. We've been on the road for about five hours already. Halfway there. Halfway there. All right, just stop for gas. You just got into Virginia, and I saw a big sign for 209, so I had to stop. I was at about a quarter tank, so that was a good time to fill up. Uh, 209 is that's amazing the last place that I stopped where did I get gas Georgia was 233 so it's like 24 cents take that for sure uh, ran in went to the bathroom real quick we're back on the road back on the road we've got a little bit we're a little bit delayed because we hit a bunch of traffic in South Carolina for like 30 minutes that they they shut 95 down to only one lane for some road work. Like, why are you doing road work in the middle of the afternoon? You know, people have places to go. Anyways, no big deal. In Virginia now, probably looking more towards 9, 9.15 arrival time. But we're forever getting closer. We're ever getting closer. I definitely just pissed off a truck driver. My bad, dude. I kind of cut him off. About an hour and a half away, give or take, maybe a little bit. So we're looking like right around nine o'clock. I just passed King's Dominion. If you've been to King's Dominion, let me know in the comments below how it is. So I've always wanted to go, but I've never gotten the chance. I mean, I wish I could have done it this trip, but I'm gonna have to take a trip down. But let me know if you've been to King's Dominion or whatever your favorite, uh, whatever your favorite amusement park is. Let me know. time catching up and then we both got to work Mac and working Mac and working Go busy weekend ahead I'm gonna end today's video right here long day of travel last two days but we're at destination one uh, for the next three days so really looking forward to the weekend lots of fun stuff planned here in DC and I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. Normal Saturday video. And this is just a bonus. You're welcome. That's going to do it for me tonight, guys. Two long days of travel done. Ready for the weekend. Leave a like, comment, subscribe. Share with your friends. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Let's be the deli. Peace out.